Hey guys, it's Emily with Cozy Clicks, and today I want to show you how you can create balance in your images inside of Photoshop by creating symmetry. Now, sometimes you might look at your picture and really like one side of it and wish the other side looked similar or had more balance, like this picture here. I really love the look of the pillars on the left side of the image. They're nice and straight. But on the other side of the image, they're a little bit slanted and they're a different shade, different tone than the other side. So I wanna create symmetry there. This is what you would do. You're going to go to the rectangular mar marquee tool and it's just the dotted rectangle that you see on the, the left side of your screen. And I'm going to click and I'm going to drag a rectangle over the area that I want to duplicate. Okay. And I'm going to let go. Now from there, inside that rectangle, I am going to right click and I'm going to choose Leia via copy. Now, once I click that, it doesn't look like much has happened. But if you go over to the adjustment panels, you'll see a new layer popped up. And that new layer is just the selection that I made. Now, if we were to take the move tool, which is this one up at the top, we could move that layer anywhere we wanted to. And you'll see it's just the selection that we made. However, to create symmetry or balance, we need the opposite of that layer. So to do that, what we're going to do is make sure that selection or that layer is selected over here. You can see it's highlighted. And we're going to go up to Edit, Transform, and we're going to flip this horizontal on this image because we want it to flip flop horizontally. If you were trying to create balance on an image and you wanted the top to go down to the bottom or vice versa, you would choose vertical. But for this image, we'll hit flip horizontal. Now I'm just going to continue to move the move, the move tool and slide that to a spot where it creates more balance. And you can see already, doesn't it look much nicer having both sides look very straight and the same tone. Now I don't want it exactly identical because well, you can see right here, my subjects are also identical. So we need to fix that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure the layer is selected. I'm going to create a layer mask just by click, clipping, clicking on this one right here. And then with the white layer mask selected, you can see it's highlighted right here. I'm going to go over and make sure black is selected, grab my brush and make sure that it is a soft brush and just brush off first my subjects because I don't want duplicating or symmetry in my subjects. And I'm also going to brush off in my layer mask anything else in my image that I don't want to be exactly symmetrical. So for here, I might erase, oops, let's go back a little bit. I might erase certain parts of the image up here so it's not exactly perfect. And I might leave the bushes over in the background here too so it doesn't look perfectly symmetrical. I'm also going to really, let me click it back to black, really look at the sidewalk here to make sure that the lines are in and make sure that everything is still selected correctly. And there you go. I created balance in this image just by taking one side and creating symmetry and flipping it to the other side. Give it a try, you guys. I would love to see how you use this technique in your own photos. If you do, I'm always over in the Cozy Clicks Facebook community group, you can post your picture over there where you have created balance. Or if you're not on Facebook, you can always tag me over on Instagram. My handle is at Cozy Clicks. So I can see what you're creating. I always love to see what you guys do with these tutorials. I appreciate you watching today. Thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, you can right here. And I would really appreciate that. And I will see you guys next week with more Photoshop tips. Bye, guys.